Hey, this is Alex from Gretel. Today we're going to walk through a complete end-to-end -end example of setting up a deep learning box for training synthetic models inside your own environment. Best place to start here is with the Gretel Docs site. So if you just go to docs.gretel.ai, we're going to follow the instructions in the environment setup guide. So first thing you'll want to do is set up a machine somewhere that's connected to an NVIDIA or deep learning compatible GPU. Um, options are GCP, Azure, AWS, your choice. Um, today we'll be setting up a box that I configured running a base Ubuntu 18.04 instance inside GCP. Go ahead and SSH in. See if I can make the font here a little bigger. Great, we have our base instance here. The first thing we want to do is set up Docker. So we'll use Docker to run our deep learning containers in the background. This script here, we'll go ahead and set up Docker to run on our instance. Great, Docker's up and running. Next thing we'll do is make sure we have the um, user added to the group. Set up correctly. And we'll make sure that the uh, user has correct privileges to run. To confirm whether Docker is running next, we're going to run Docker PS. In Ubuntu, you need to run uh, sudo first. So sudo docker. Here we can see that Docker service is running correctly, even though we don't have any containers running at the moment. We're ready for the next step. So since this is a little different, we're configuring our deep learning box. We're going to skip past the uh, API setup instructions for now and we're going to go down to the GPU plus Docker configuration. So here we're going to add the extra drivers necessary for um, Docker to be able to use the uh, machine's GPU. We've made a simple uh, setup script here, and this is going to install TensorFlow. This will install the correct um, and appropriate matching uh, NVIDIA driver versions in CUDA as well. This process takes a while, um, so go ahead and grab a cup of coffee and we'll come on back. Looks like uh, the uh, and driver installation completed. What we see it doing now is downloading a, uh, an image from Docker that it verifies the ability to interact with the GPU. So the driver has been set up correctly. You can see running the NVIDIA SMI command here inside of the container shows us that it does detect and is able to talk to the Tesla T4 GPU we have. You can also run the same command from your local instance. So you can clear this and just run NVIDIA SMI. And uh, now we can be confident that the drivers are set up and running correctly. Jump in for the next video on end-to-end uh, -end training on a local box here uh, using the Gretel SDK.